I'm going to show you how to export and import indicator, market scan, and trading system programs with ProRealTime. This feature allows you to share your programs with other users or import ones that someone else has shared with you directly to your platform. The importing and exporting works the same way with each kind of program, indicators, market scans, and trading systems. First, let's look at how to export a trading system. I've opened this window here, Indicators and Trading Systems. You can get there by clicking on this button on any chart. Then simply click on either Indicators or Backtesting and Automatic Trading. Select the system you want to export. Then click Export. You will see three options. As it says, exporting the trading system will create a file which can be imported by you or friends into their workstations. You then have to choose the appropriate level of protection for this file. You can choose none. The code will be fully editable. That's the default option. Code not modifiable if you don't want the person who imports it to be able to modify or see the code. And code not modifiable with unique import, meaning the file will only be able to be imported once and then it will not be able to be used again. Let's choose the first option and push export. We then have to choose a place to save the file. I'm going to save it on my desktop and you'll see that it's going to be saved as an ITF file. All pro real time programs, indicators, trading systems, or market scanners are going to be ITF files, and this is how you'll know that you'll be able to import that program to your platform. Click Export to Finish, and we'll have the export results be displayed. It says the trading system breakout intraday was successfully exported, and that's how you export a trading system. Note that it is not possible to export programs whose codes are not visible or modifiable. For example, I'm going to select this program, FIBO EURUSD, click Modify, and for this particular program, the code is unavailable. Therefore, this program cannot be exported. You'll be able to see easily if a program is exportable or not because the export icon will be active on exportable programs. Now let's look at an indicator. To export a personal indicator, select an indicator with its name written in italics. Then click export, just like for the trading systems. You'll notice that predefined indicators that are included in the platform by default are not exportable. The ones that are exportable are programs written by you or other programs that have been imported and that have their code available. So if you are able to click on either modify or export, you'll know that the code is exportable. You'll also see that the personal indicators like this are written in italics. So again, if we want to export this program, I can just click here on export, select the protection, click export, and I've now exported an indicator as well. Now let's look at a screener. To do that, I'm going to go to display choose Pro Screener, then I'll click here to edit my Pro Screeners. This window will come up and you'll see that the import and export options are also available. I'm going to click here to export my Pro Screener. Choose the protection, export it, and that's finished. Now we'll look at importing. To import a program, you just need to use the import button shown here. You can use this button from the Pro Screener Management window or from the indicators or trading systems list. It doesn't matter. For example, you can import an indicator from the Pro Screener list. It doesn't matter. Just click import, choose a file to import it. For example, here I'm going to select the trading system. I click import. It'll ask me if I want to replace the program that already exists with the one I'm moving. I click yes. Then it says the system was successfully imported and it's going to save the platform. 
The system is then displayed in the list of trading systems. This can be done also from any other window. Just click import and then for example we can import this. Yes. And now it's imported that indicator. To learn more, click on one of the links that appears on the screen.